Tonight is the opening night of Light Up UCF, which is like a Christmas winter fair thing our school does. And apparently students get in for free today. So my friends and I are going to go check that out. We are doing the kitty train first because we are adults and we do adult things like tiny trains. thing before going and getting donuts and then trying to get on that winter world ride. that this thing's open. And the event is closed for the night. 
because it's past midnight. As you might have been able to tell from my attempts to film myself while skating, um, I can do it, but I think the last time I actually went ice skating was for my 16th birthday. So that was obviously a while ago. So I can, I'm pitch black right now, I'm outside, and again, it's past midnight. So I can try and skate, but I'm not the best at it. Certainly was not the worst there, though. I only fell once. So that's the end of Light Up UCF, day one, student day one. It was a lot of fun. I'm glad we were able to check it out for free. I think there's a second free day later this month. Uh, I got to do everything I wanted to do. The train, the slide, the winter whirl, which is the most intense thing there and ice skating and then there's also the ferris wheel but i'm terrified of heights so ferris wheel did not happen so yeah uh light up ucf is basically like a mini fair that's like winter christmas themed and it's got a bit to do the lines are long enough that you're probably going to be there like the whole time it's open which is fine because it's a lot of fun and it is it starts at 8, it's 8 to midnight, so it is like cool outside by the time you start. And it was just like a ton of fun. All of it was fun, especially like the fake snow, bubble snow type stuff they had. Because that's just how Florida is. We gotta make our own snow because it ain't gonna happen naturally. That event was definitely worth it heading out and doing even though it's kind of late not really late for me but like for my friends it was a bit late uh it was especially worth it because it was again free for students here so like you didn't lose any money and you got to do a ton of fun stuff which i really appreciate the school seems to do that pretty often there is going to be a second student day i don't know if it's on the 28th or 29th i want to say 29th because it's a Thursday as well, but it's either November 28th or 29th. It's free, again, for students. And so, like, probably gonna do it again because why would you not? Slightly in the future, Mickey interjection. I just remembered that the event started on Wednesday night and that my phone says Thursday because it's past midnight, which makes me think maybe student night will be on the 28th instead of the 29th i don't know it's one of those two days it'll probably go up on a notification later that will be a more reliable source than me half remembering what they said over the intercom in the rink i expect that will be a ton of fun and any other events that the school puts on or i find or whatever especially since it's getting into the holiday season and so there's a lot of fun holiday things to do but for now this weird street light is it. Ciao.